Long ago, after a long fight between humans and monsters, humans won. They sealed the monsters underground with a powerful spell. In order to break the barrier. Seven souls had to be captured. There were only three souls left. Mount Ebbet. The legends say that those who climb this mountain never return. Their fate is to die. But one day, someone full of kindness would appear and change the underground forever. He fell through the innumerable floor of the ruins. and found the old mines. Undertale. Green. Hello everyone, welcome to Undertale Green. My name's Esserol. We're once again back here with another Undertale fan game. This time we're playing Undertale Green. The fan game is made by Migs. It's basically a fan game that takes place before Undertale. It's like, what happens if you played through the game as the Green Soul? What, what was the game through their perspective? What did they go through? It's basically the same premise as Undertale Yellow, except we're playing as Kindness instead of Justice. I don't know the character's name. I don't even know anything about this fan game, actually. All I know is that as I was looking forward to playing Undertale Yellow, a whole list of games popped up, so... Here we are. Cody... Okay. Controls are a bit different this time, but we we get Undying? What? Hey! Stop right there, human! You you are a human, right? Uh my name Undying. We have baby Undying in this bitch. My name's Undying. I really wish to join the Royal Guard when I grow up. It's just my dad who doesn't want the same. He wants me to go to college. Wait, why do I bother waste my time talking to you? You are a human, and humans are enemies. Perhaps capturing your soul will make my dad proud of me. Halt, you are about to be defeated. Eat it, human. Oh wait, you have nothing to protect yourself. Not really fair, is it? And I need exactly the opposite. Here, take this, frying pan. At least you can say it's not fair. What's going on? What am I doing? I don't want to hurt you. I just want to be strong. You are strong. Really? Do you think so? Why are you being so kind to me? Anyway, follow me, human. Let's find a way out of this place. Hello. Looks like this guy's been working on this wall for a long time. Looking for monsters to work in the mines. Hey, human! Why not try that flower bed before we go? You feel something you've never felt before. Wait, we save on a flower bed now? Hello! Do you want some orange juice? The first three are for free. Oh, I wish I could find a better rhyme. So I wouldn't need to give juice for free. Yeah, thanks, you. Really? You want more juice? Can you at least give me some tips? Thanks, you. Yo, my man actually looks sad now. Here we go. Fluffy wants to play. 
Buffy, attack four, defense three, football is everything for him. Wanna be my goalkeeper? Yo, they actually changed the battle system. A uh, play. You decided to play with Fluffy. Seems so happy you can't stop smiling. Don't let the ball get in. Okay. Yo, I already like this. What the hell? Who are you? Oh no. Oh no. Puzzles. Puzzles everywhere! Hello, human. Nice to meet you. I'm Cooper, the guardian of these mines. Looks like you've been here. Are you lost? I'd really like to help you, but... There's just freaking... Puzzles everywhere! Humans are good at puzzles, right? Can you help me out? I can't look at these lasers anymore. Another encounter? Sad mushroom can't stop crying. I already hate these names. Attack 3, defense 5, he doesn't care about life anymore. Life is so unfair. Um, hello? That attack wasn't... I just want to go back to bed. I can't control the... You say that no one cares about him cries even more. Are y'all hearing the music? I forget who theme that was, but that's definitely... Okay... Um... Done, bro. It's a newspaper article. Suspicious news in the underground. The underground's royal guard found out that there's a virus all around. Some clues suggest that someone used chemical products to deliberately make a virus. Why would you do that? It's a very dangerous and mortal virus. So we recommend you stay home and. Okay. You feel kindness in the air. Hello. Hello! How are you doing? I'm kind of running and doing exercising today. Oh, you kind of want to get out of the way, don't you? Because you want to... Because you kind of want to get to the other side, right? Guess what? I kind of don't care. You better kind of go the way, because I'm going to kind of keep moving. Okay. What the... Gary hates everything. Okay. I have to use control for this, don't I? Gary, attack 3, defense 5. Gary hates being checked. I hate ducks. Eh, it doesn't matter. I guess the green soul mode always was easier with keyboard. Gary hates everything. Uh, talk. Gary hates talking. I hate the quadratic equation. Seems like the same rules apply. If they turn red, then that's the next arrow gonna hit. Gary hates jokes. I'm going to die. Can I flee? Bye? Where are my employees? Where is everyone? This guy's kind of weird, isn't he? I can hear what you're saying. Oh, sorry, Mr. Ugh. Cooper. Yeah, Mr. Scooter. <laughs> It's Koopa! With a C! Yay, ugh. I think everyone is not here because they are at home. At home? Oh no, why me? I can't take this anymore. Everyone is going to be fired. Oh, come on. It's not that bad. You're just kind of hiding from that thing from the news. What? What thing? Someone released evil viruses on the caves. It can be even mortal. Not everyone is at home, afraid of getting infected. What am I going to do now? But hey, what's wrong? Lasers, traps, puzzles. Puzzles everywhere. Well, maybe we can help you. Human, we better solve this problem. Otherwise, he might explode. 
So if I get hit even once, I'm going to set back to the beginning. What now? Note, these names suck. I'm just saying this. Look, no offense, but these names are awful. Attack 4, Defense 5, yellow is his favorite color. Let's get creative. Uh, yellow? Yellow's his favorite color. He seems very happy. What's your favorite idea? What happened? I mean, I activated this switch, so... Kindness is the language which the deaf can hear and the blind can see. Ah, uh, you show sure about that? I'm dying. Dude! Is that a minecart? Cool, wanna take a ride? Hey, I was thinking. We have been here together and you are very cool, but... I don't even know your name. So what is it? Cody? Oh, that's a nice name. Hey, remember when you said you were gonna help me make my dad proud? I never said that. Well, you didn't actually say that. You don't talk so often. But you'll help, right? And I think I already know how. Do you remember that thing from the news? You know, these news about someone releasing a virus? Was it Corona? Maybe we can find some... find who it was. Then we're gonna bust him! Oh, my dad will be so proud. He'll finally like me. <laughs> He'll see that I'm not a loser. I can already see the headlines. Undying leader of the Royal Guard. What a dream. But I know that will never happen. Anyway, I think I know where we can start. We should investigate Cooper first. You think he's the bad guy? I mean, he's just a weird turtle. But no one's innocent until we have proof they are. And anyway, we need to start somewhere, right? Maybe we can sneak through his office and see if we can find anything in his files. Oh, Cody, this is so cool. It's like playing detectives. Wait, why did we stop? Hi, this is Cooper from the loudspeaker. Just a warning for everyone on the minecart rails. Leave them immediately! Scar is coming! What? What does he mean by... What? Scart? Attack 3, defense 9, he has a big nose and a cool minecart. Minecraft. I'm the coolest in the mines! What's going on? Scart is ruling the lines, um... Jump? You make a perfect jump inside the minecarts. Awesome! Do something harder now. You want to stay in the middle for this one. You do another awesome triple jump. Oh my god! Something harder, please! Harder! I was way off. I need to heal. Oh shit, I don't have any items. I'm backflip. You do a backflip over Undying's head and you land on the border of the minecart. Incredible! I guess I found someone better than me. I'm going to die, I'm going to die, I'm going to die. Yo, that was way too close. Well, that was a cool minecart show. But we really have to get back on the track. Scart, literally. So, can you, uh, let us pass? No! I want to see that again! No! Scart, stop jumping! But I want to see more tricks, please! Scart, please! We need to go! But I loved your minecart skills! Show me more! Stop it now! You're gonna make us fall! Oh no, this isn't good. We are in one of the deepest areas of the mines. We need to find a way out of here. There's not much light in here. So it'll be hard to see. Go ahead, I'm right behind you. Okay. Have we... Oh, we're holding a torch. I was like... 
Our our side sprite looks different. Who now? Arcade offers all sorts of video game choices. Um, attack seven, defense four. This arcade machine is looking for your coins. Pause. No. So, this game should... I don't know the name of it, but it's very obvious what it is. Is this Asriel Steam? Um... Unplug. I'm this close to just fleeing, because you're honestly pissing me off. This gives me rock tunnel vibes, I don't know why. Maybe it's because of the flash mechanic, or... Tickets! This machine is still tickets for an upcoming show tomorrow. Buy a ticket for 15G? Why not? You got a ticket. This looks like a complex puzzle, Cody. Do you see all those conveyor belts? I think this switch changes their directions. I guess you gotta solve this in team, then. Try to find a way to deactivate the blue lasers. I'll be right here next to the switch. Press Z or enter if you want me to change their direction. Wind up soldiers ready for action again. I'm guessing wind up. It's an interesting concept, all of this. How am I going to... Do I, like, have to immediately... Okay. Please tell me there's a save point coming up. Yep. Look, Cody! We're almost there! The exit is right up there! Looks like a few more stairs and we're good to go. Is that spaghetti? I'm guessing Papyrus is coming up. Play spaghetti, you can now sell at the healing item store. I'm dying, you coming or not? Look, Cody! Cooper's office, and it's right next to the exit. But we can't leave yet. We still have something to do. We need to find out if Cooper released the virus. Let's find files or anything to start our investigations. Doesn't look like he's around, so let's get in and out quickly. If he finds us, we're boned. Let's go. It's time to find the truth. Why boned? I don't see sands of papyrus anywhere. Now quick! Search for the files or anything. I'll be at the door to tell you if he's coming. Looks like Cooper was working on the news project for the old mines. Is there anything suspicious about these papers? You're very quiet, Cody. Did you find anything? Tell me. What is it? Oh no! Cooper's coming! Fast! Hide! I'll block the door! There's no empty space. It's not time. Go to call your mom. I'm sorry, where am I supposed to hide? Useless paper. No, I can't draw myself right now. This is unbelievable! I'm out for an hour! 
to buy some things at Snowden. And this is what I get when I come back. I find you two in my office playing detectives. What are you even looking for? Cooper, I'm sorry, we just... I thought maybe you had something to do with that virus. Oh no, not again. Why me? Hey, what's wrong? I don't want this. They're exactly like them. What? What are you talking about? I'm getting nervous. It's all happening again. Dude, are you alright? No. <laughs> no, I'm not. They did the same thing to me in the past. And I won't let it happen again. I might look like a goofy turtle to you. And many tried to do the same. I'll make sure this is the last time. Side of Cooper that you've never seen before blocks your pie. I'm guessing you're the tutorial of this. Attack 4 defense 20, a goofy turtle that doesn't seem so goofy anymore. I obtained this purple power a year ago to defend myself. Really? Uh, I guess it's something new. Come talk. You try to talk to Cooper, but he is determined to do what he needs to do. I have to admit that I'm kind of nervous. How was I supposed to... What is going on? Come on, hit me. Show me what you've got. Side of Cooper that you've never seen, uh, pun. You make a turtle pun, Cooper doesn't react. Maybe he doesn't like puns. Why are you not hitting me? You're wondering, what the shell is going on? Can I talk again? Why can't I hate you? I should hate you. So from the looks of it, his attacks are just really easy. You just gotta learn not to overreact. Well, you always helped when I needed it. Look, you can just go here and then you can go up and down. Wait a minute, is this Robbie Rotten? We are number one. Oh, we can just spare him like that, sweet. Thank you, human, for everything. I didn't expect you to not fight back. I expected you to be like them. Now I understand. Now I understand that you're exactly the opposite. Sorry for asking, Cooper, but who are them? I don't really want to talk about it. I really hope you understand. Is there any way I can help you? You forgive this goofy turtle, who's not so goofy anymore. Is there any information you can give us about them? Maybe those fighters are the ones who released the virus. The underground clockwork facility. Wow, thank you so much, Cooper. Cody, we have to go there and bust them. Then I'll finally impress my dad. Come on, it's time to go. Undertale. Green? Chapter 2, The Dark Forest. Alright. Looks like we're out of the mines, Cody. Now that we can finally go catch those bad guys that released the virus. It's so cool. Feels like we're on a mission. There's just one thing that I really need to do. Before we start our investigation, I have to visit a friend that lives in Snowden. I need to go through the longer path to do so. But you take this shortcut, Cody. If you go straight across the woods, you can get to the clockwork facility way faster. I'll meet you there soon, alright Cody? Oh, I almost forgot. It's really cold out there in the woods. Make sure to wear something warm, okay? Anyway, see you later. Kindness is seeing the best in others when they can't see it in themselves. Okay. Hello, want to check out my new shop? Grab some snow and you're here to go. I tried to sell water here, but then it froze. But it's okay, because I came up with this jingle about snow. The thing about jingle be I had before was, please don't bother and drink some water. Yeah, it didn't come out that great. Okay. 
What the hell? Ah! You should have seen your face! I scared you so much. I can't wait to tell my friends about this. Oh, who am I kidding? I don't have friends. I can't scare anyone. You... you mean it? Is this... Metaton as a ghost? Thank you! That makes me so happy! My name is Snitch. Nice to meet you. Can you tell me your name? Cody, is it? I haven't seen a human in a very long time. You know what, Cody? There's a reason why I'm sad. No matter how hard I try, I can't scare anyone. The other ghosts are really mean to me because of it. Actually, there's only two other ghosts. Billy and Trevor. What happened to Napstabook and... They're really scary, but I don't like talking about it. Let's talk about you, human. Looks like you're on a mission. What? The Clockwork Factory? Please, let me guide you there. I know every path of the woods. Follow me, friend. This way. Look, friend! It's a puzzle! The Dark Polish is filled with those. Do you think you can solve it? Ice Cream is screaming. Attack for defense 5, it takes a piece of ice, but the only gets life purpose is screaming. Like, I... took way longer than that should have. Oh, I love this puzzle. I promise I won't give it away. There we go. And that's when I told her, you can't tell me what to do. Yo, whoa, 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 whoa. Yo, the beds, Billy. Women are dumb. You know what else is, d you know what else is dumb, Trevor? What, bro? Dogs. And squirrels. And boats. I actually like boats. Yeah, boats are fine. I saw a boat today! That's great, bro. So, how was your day? Pretty good, at bro. I haven't seen Stitch all day, though. I'm pretty sure his name is Switch. No, I think it's Stitch. Wanna go look for him? Sure. Let's get him. Let's beat him up? What? Let's hope they don't find us. <laughs> Yo, that opening line though, bro. Chill with that. I can't say it. I was flying, but I got distracted. So I bumped my head into this tree. It's now really hurting. I should probably put something cold on it. I wonder where I'm gonna find anything like that. <laughs> ah, here we go. This one's my personal favorite. I think it's a great tribute to the king. Blind ghost didn't see you coming. Pack 3, defense 6, this goat is either blind or he really likes sunglasses. If I can't see, so can't you. Uh, he sang a song, the blind ghost seems to be enjoying it.
There we go. Be kind whenever possible, it is always possible. My dad used to take me ice fishing when I was little. Now that he's away, I still do it every day. Oh look, I'm catching something. It's a silver coin. Take it. You probably need it more than I do. You got a silver coin. Okay. Healing shop. I still don't know what these are for. Oh, what? Another dolphin? What? Seely grabs your attention. Seely attack 8, defense 7. Only needs a ball and a river to have fun. What? What just happened? Um... Compliment, you tell Seely how great she is. Seely squeeze infusion. You start dancing Makarina. Seely really seems pretty bothered. Don't steal the spotlight, you said? I'm dead. Yeah, that looked like the fight that would kill me. You cannot give up just yet. Cody, you are our only hope. That's new. You ask Seely to do a trick with the ball. She throws the ball up and grabs it in the air. Give Silly feedback. You tell Silly her trick was amazing, Silly's having fun. You clap with you, your hands with enthusiasm, Seely's having fun. He swims to the bottom of the river and rockets back up doing a midway backflip. Can I still not spare you? Compliment. There. Damn. That was real fun. Seely must repeat human. See human again sometime. Well, that was different. We're almost out of the woods, friend. But there is still a bit more left to walk. Oh, I can't wait to show you what's next. I just know you're gonna love it. Meanwhile, in Snowden. Yep, I knew it. Papyrus is that tall even here? Sansa! I can't find my tie! You don't wear a tie, bro. I could wear a tie if I knew where to find one! That's because your room's a mess. Why don't you tie it up? Sans! What have we agreed to jokes? Alright, bro. Why do we need a tie anyway? I have to look good for Asgore's party. I'll look so good that everyone will want to be my friend. Even the Royal Guard. Although I, the Great Papyrus, would never want to join the Royal Guard. What? I would be way better than everyone else. They wouldn't be fair. Oh my god! It's undying! Sons! How do I look? You look good, bro. 
So good, it makes me want to be your friend. That's the answer I was looking for. I can't do it. I'm too nervous. I'll be the first to talk if you want. Yes, that's helpful. Let's do it. Hi, Sans. You look good, Paps. Have you tried wearing it with a tie? I told you I should be wearing a tie. Sundine, what have you, what have you been doing? Oh, I have so much to tell you. You're not going to believe what happened. So, I've met this human. Let me stop you right there. <laughs> you do realize he's a human, right? Yeah, so what? You have a problem with that? I don't, but Asgore might have. Don't forget, he's trying to capture human souls. That's completely silly! Why would someone ever want to capture a human? Uh, <laughs> Guys, there's nothing to worry about. We're solving a crime. Once we arrest the bad guy, my dad will finally love me. Asgore will probably thank Cody and me. Nothing could possibly go wrong. I wonder how she would react if we killed Cooper. And I obviously forgot my papyrus voice. We're finally here, Underground's yearly circus. I decided not to tell you about it to make you to make it a surprise. Towns and monsters from all over the underground come here every year. There's also full of games and attractions. I'm so excited. It's the opening night. Friend, can I tell you a secret? This is the only place where I actually feel happy. I forgot all about my problems in this place. It's like a world where Billy and Trevor never existed. Do you understand? Anyway, it's going to be a great night. Let's go in. I'll show you around. We're now inside the circus, friend. Look around. This place is full of fun games. Do you play them with for me? I never got a chance to actually play. Because, you know, I'm a ghost. Feel free to try everything. The night's still young. Snail ra- Wait, wait, we have fights even in here? Yek Numb is stuck upside down. Uh... Cool. Try to pull Yucknum, but he's still stuck. I want to come down. Excuse me. The controls are reversed, oh, of course. Oh, tickle. You tickle the monkey is in his belly. Yucknum's now 50% loose. Bro, I swear I'm pressing the buttons and it's not letting me move. Why am I still upside down? No! No! That's Thunder Snail, a very popular game among ghosts. You need to encourage your snail by pressing Z, or enter. The more you encourage it, the faster it goes. If your snail reaches finish, you win. Simple, right? Try it out. Race starts in three, two, one, go. Other snail one. You won the race. You've got 35 gold. Great, let's try the other one now. The three cups game, start. I think it's the second one. Got a completely useless ball. You can now sell it at the healing shop. Good job! And then she looks at me and asks, Billy, can you let me drive your car? Bro! What, Trevor? You're great. You're great too. You should run for president of this circus. And you should run for president of this town. You should run for king. You can't run for king. I know I can't. I'm not that great. I was saying you can. No, I mean, you can't. It's impossible. I'm pretty sure it's possible. I don't think so, bro. I saw a great joke today. Tell me, bro. I... I don't quite remember. That's too bad, bro. 
Want to go find Snitch? Sure. Let's beat it, Mel. I can't believe it. Billy and Trevor are here? That's not supposed to happen. It's the only place where I'm happy. The only place where I'm free. Everything is going wrong this night. What's this vending machine about? Conveniently place soda vending machine. What's the deal with the items in? Huh. My my friends t told me to ride the roller coaster. It will be fun. They said it wasn't. I definitely w wasn't. Right here next to the switch. You know what to do if you need me to press. There we go. This is my favorite attraction of all time, friend. Would you like to try it with me? Here we are, friend. My favorite place in the world. So quiet and peaceful. It gives me time to think a lot about everything. Can I convince something to you? Confess something to you? I'm tired, Cody. I really am. You didn't appear. Today I probably... I don't know what I would have done with my life. I'm different from the other ghosts. I'm not scary. I don't have friends. Billy and Trevor keep saying mean things about me all the time. But you know what? They're right. I'm a loser. I always will be. I really wanted to believe that. But when someone says a lot of mean things about you during your entire life, you actually start to believe those things. You think I should do that? I can't. I never confronted everyone before. What if they beat me up? You're serious? You think it's going to work? Thank you for being so kind to me. But I know what you're... Well, what they're capable of really scares me. And it should scare you too. Oh, look who finally decided to show up. But Billy. What, bro? I've been here the whole time. I was talking about Snitch. Snitch? Where? Right there. Oh, look, bro. Snitch is right there. I was just saying that. Look, he has a friend. That's impossible. Snitch has no friends. Hey, stupid loser! How much did you pay him to be your with you? Maybe the human is scared of him. You're going to stay there in complete silence? Say something, freak! Ugh. Say it! I... You know what, Trevor? What, bro? We have so much fun beating him sn up, Snitch. How much fun will it be beating up the two of them? Just casually plays rules cards theme. The audience is waiting. The stage is set. Bro, wait. What? I just remember that joke. I. What are you talking about? A joke I couldn't remember before. Can I tell you the joke? All right, hurry up. Why are skeletons so calm? Why? Cause nothing gets under their skin. That's a terrible joke. I find it pretty funny. Can we go on? Sure, bro. Anyway, the audience is waiting. The stage is set. Snitch! Human that never told me his name. Prepare to be part of the best circus show of your lives. Not only it will be the best show of your lives, it will also be your last one. Billy and Trevor are about to beat you up. 
Attack. Attack, no defense, 999. The older brother ready to beat you up. Wait, they're brothers. Trevor! Yeah, bro. It's time to finally use our special attack. Really? But wait a sec. What? 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 You told me to wait a second. When did I say that? It was literally five seconds ago. I don't think I told you to wait a second. Our special attack! Oh, that's a great idea. Why don't we use it? Oh no, Billy! Billy and Trevor are using the special attack. They used that on me a couple of times. Do you see that heat meter over there? No matter what happens, you can't let that meter get full. If you let it full all the way, your soul will catch on fire. And you'll start losing HP. That ball will start to fill if you, in if you're standing still. So just keep moving. Do you hear me, friend? Whatever you do, don't stop moving. I am so confused. Check. Trevor, same, uh, likes bad jokes. Help me with this attack, Trevor. On it, bro. Uh, what happens if I talk to them? You politely ask the ghost to stop bullying you. Snitch is only 10% convinced about speaking up to them. It's bullet hell time, bro. If you say so, bro. This is bullet hell. You're going to love this attack, human. I absolutely love it myself. Okay, now I gotta heal. You're too quiet, snitch. There's something you'd like to share with the rest of the class? Um... Third defense convinced about what you're saying. I personally hate this attack. It bugs me the way it never hits the corners. Party defense convinced. So if you let it fill up, you get karma damage. I see. Well, this is the only attack we have left. That's not good, bro. Ugh, Trevor, we ran out of attacks. Why don't we use some repeated ones? Sometimes you have great ideas, bro. Willing is now at 50%. Snitch finally makes up his mind and decides to talk back to Billy and Trevor. What did you say? I said, I'll talk. Ooh, someone seems angry. What's the matter? You didn't like our little show? Listen up, I'm tired of having to deal with you. Who do you think you're talking to, stupid loser? No, you are a stupid loser, Busy. You make the others suffer for fun. I swear if you keep- Shut up! I'm talking! You're the one who doesn't have friends. At least not any real ones. And you know what, Billy? You don't scare me anymore. I'm done talking to you. I preferred you when you didn't speak. <laughs> Wait, that's all they had to say? Friend, that was awesome. I can't thank you enough. I'm finally feeling better about myself. I'm so glad we became friends. Thank you for everything, Cody. That was just a stupid fight. Whoa! Okay, you got me that time. It worked, didn't it? I can't believe I scared someone. You should have seen your face. I can't believe you have to leave so soon. We had a great time, didn't we? When I understand, you're on a mission. Your other friend is counting on you. Yes, I know about Undying. She's pretty popular, you know. Hope you two find what you're looking for. Here, take this device. It's used for communication. You can talk to me anytime you want. I had it since I was little, hoping someone day I'd give it to a friend. 
Now I finally have a friend. Anyway, the entrance to the clockwork factory is right up there. And Cody, please look after her dying. She's young and she doesn't know a lot about what she's doing. The king finds out that she's friends with a human. Well, things might go on a bit wrong. Anyway, let's hope for our best, for the best friend. Uh, hello. Dad! There's something I want to tell you. I... met a friend today. I thought that nonsense of making random friends was over. Don't you think it's time to grow up? No, Dad. You don't understand. It's different this time. I know this will make you proud. You're going to investigate the clockwork factory. You're going to catch the bad guy that released the virus. You are going to do what? D don't worry, Dad. Cody will help me. It's a very nice human in- A human? Did you know we have to live here because of those freaky humans? They ruined everyone's lives. They, they, they need to be captured and killed. But, Dad, if only- I forbid you from ever seeing him again. Do you understand? And stop with that investigation nonsense. Am I making myself clear? That's not fair! You... you only say that to me because... Because you don't have any friends. Whoa! He woke up Chris Breezy. Let this serve as a lesson. Never, ever talk back to me. That was cold! We continue to chapter 3. Damn! Okay, tell me how you really feel. <laughs> uh, overall, I'd give this fan game a... <laughs> what the hell did I just watch? A 7 out of 10. I'm lowering the score because there were a lot of glitches and some of the controls don't seem to be fined out. For example, you can use the like the the d-pad on controller but the other controls don't work very well in battle and there also seem to be some other glitches and bugs but it's overall a good fan game i i think everyone should try it out especially since it's, it has like two hours worth of content don't forget to check it out and uh yeah this been world hope you all enjoyed i'll leave the download link for the game in the description uh peace